guys if you expected him here uh, and maybe were disappointed if you are a big K9 fan. But that is the reason why. Uh, K9, let's see. So Temple, I know, goes Mac. He has some secondaries. Uh, K9 has been playing, I believe, a lot more Wolf, and that's what I expect to see from him. But we may see some counter picks here from both of these players because I know they have, both have deep, deep pockets. K9 was messing around with Joker a lot. In fact, I know he plays Joker and, and Wolf a lot. I can't remember which one he's decided he's kind of going to settle in, but I know he uses them for different matchups. Um, I don't know who else Tempo plays. Uh, I've seen him playing some other characters. I just can't off the top of mine or my mind remember who. But I expect him to go with his main first, which is Mac. Um, and let's find out. Yes, Mac and K9 going Sheik. This matchup was god awful in Smash 4, and I don't expect it to be that much better. Uh, Sheik has a, a lot. Has, doesn't have a lot of trouble carrying um, Mac off stage with her combos. Um, and that can be a real problem for Mac, Mac because that's exactly where you do not want to be. And we're already seeing that with K9 right now. It, uh, another thing that K9 is, is pretty good at in this game is his ledge trapping. So uh, I, I really like this choice coming out from K9. He may struggle to find the kill a little bit. Uh, or uh, get cheesed hard by Mac because Sheik is an extremely light character and um, Mac's moves are very strong. But right now it seems to be working out pretty well. That KO punch is ready though. Move is very scary, but K9 manages to avoid it for now. Okay, gets the drag down, but not at a percent where that would connect into anything. It's the F smash. He's gonna need. Uh, well, I'm sort of surprised that that's the first kill we've seen from K9. Uh, I'm expecting him to, if he wins this match, I don't expect him to be getting those kinds of reads. It needs to be um, coming out with these edge guards and ledge traps and just keep sending Mac back out there until he cannot return. Uh, and yeah, here we go. This is exactly what K9 needs to do. And what an amazing bounce off the stage, hitting it tempo back off stage. <laughs> be here. Okay. Tempo in another combo here. He is down two stocks right now, but Mac does have some comeback factor. I mean, this character hits really hard. Um, now, fortunately for Mac, if K9 feels like he's getting outplayed, he can always retreat to those platforms. But uh, it seems for now K9 is, is meeting him at, at halfway here and fighting him on stage. And uh, why wouldn't he? He's already with a commanding lead, despite losing that stock. Uh, goes for the bouncing fish, fish read. Nice. Uh, a lot of mid-level level max will like to side B from that height right there because they expect you to go off with an uh, aggressive option to s prevent them from getting back on stage and uh, they just hit you instead. But K9, instead of waiting that out, just decides to go for the bouncing fish and get the kill. So, is K9 committing to Sheik? Yes, he is. And Tempo is committing to Little Mac. That looked pretty rough, but maybe either Tempo feels like uh, he's he's able to figure this out, or he feels like um, you know maybe Mac is my best shot because I've been playing this character for the, for the most time, and he's my main. Um, or maybe he just wants to study these afterwards. Uh, but again, this matchup seems really rough. And now K9 is camping with needles. What an absolute degenerate. Don't tell him don't tell I, him I said that. Now, back to the match. K9 already taking control of the stage here. Uh, as I say that he gets hit by the forward tilt there though, and Tempo landing another forward tilt, sending K9 off stage. Uh, K9 
He'll play in it safe. Chucking needles. Uh, he just doesn't. He keeps getting hit by these forward tilts. And he's just decided he's not going to deal with Mac up close. Because this character, like I said, is scary. And now, Tempo has Pale Punch. Now that beats Shield, Jump, and a whole lot of other things. Okay, Mac, that was kind of an odd interaction there. It looked like it was armor, or maybe K9 misinputted and threw a grenade out there. Tempo punished. Okay, this is scary for K9 right now. If he gets hit by K9, like KO Punch, that could just kill him. And, uh, yeah, K9 just opting to camp on these platforms. Uh, he does not want to deal with this KO Punch. And, and, of course, when players just camp on these platforms, there's not a lot that Mac can do. Um, but now that the KO Punch is gone, K9 has elected to fight Tempo like a man. And Up Smash will take it. So, that F tilt, yeah, super fast, super strong. Great option from Lil Mac there. And now, okay, we're seeing some strings here come out from K9. Very patient, I mean, uh, very, very good at carrying him off the stage once again. Tempo now in a posi good position here. Okay, armors through the needles there. And here comes K9 again. Oh, getting hit by the uppy. Very unfortunate for K9 there. Alright, yeah, and... You know, once Mac gets close, it's so scary because he has so many uh, strong moves that can lead to a whole lot of damage and knock you around. Uh, he's just so good when he gets root up close. Uh, that jab is frame one. Um, and the F tilt is super fast too. It's, I think it's like three, it's frame three or four. And it gives you so much. What's okay. up, fans? What's up? I'm here to organize my cards, but I'm also commenting with some ours. But anyways. <laughs> Uh, Tempo, man, he's still winning, but K9, why doesn't the upper kill, man? I'm serious. Well, the thing about Sheik here is now that Sheik has a different, like, toolkit, her upper won't kill anymore. That was the thing of the past. K9 reminiscing on good, good old days. Watch, watch yourself, man. That KO punch will knock your soul out. K9 has, like, 1-0, and you're going to get Tempo. The Tempo. I'm sorry. Like, no pun intended. That's just facts. Give this man, oh, hit this man with the stankiest leg. Off the stage, please. Hell yeah, talk to him. Sometimes I, I always wonder, like, what kind of music Kane listens to. There was like a time where he listened to music when he played, and then he just stopped. So I was always curious. Yeah, some pl players like it, some players don't. Kind of interesting. Okay, yeah. K9 popping off here though. He's fine. He's kind of brought this back. Um, I don't want to do it to my boy Tempo, but like, I'm kind of rooting for K9 here, man. What's that? I don't know, dude. Sometimes you just want to root for him, like. He's got that energy. I'm th he's got that energy. He's got too. the SoCal energy. You know what he has? I always tell people the one thing that I will always admire about K9, his energy. Like nobody else has it. Like nobody, bro. Him.